Hey there, Nicole Frost of Frost Yarn. So today's video, we are going to be testing acid dyes, wash fast acid dyes from Dharma, Jacquard, and Prochem against a new line, Permacet dyes, also known as Lanaset dyes from Standard Colors. So if you want to see how they stack up, whether or not they gel, cake, bleed, separate, or strike in their component parts, follow on. And one last note. If you haven't already, consider pitching in. The cost of the dye in, used in this experiment was about $160, plus the minis, plus the time to make this video. Edit this video and make it freely available to you. Costs three bucks, heck, even one dollar, and it just helps defray the costs on my part and keep dye education freely available to the public. Thank you so much. Today we are going to be testing out wash fast acid, acid reactive dyes against Lanaset, also known as Permaset dyes that I just got from this new company called Standard Colors. So we're going to be testing my the reds I have in stock, which is Fire Engine Red from Dharma, Scarlet from um, Jacquard, Bright Red from Prochem, then the Permalon Yellow against Fluorescent Lemon from Dharma and Flavine Yellow from Prochem. And the Permaset Blue, this was the expensive dye, this one pound tub cost me 70 bucks against True Turquoise and Prochem's Turquoise. You'll notice I only have one color left of Jacquard because I phased it out of my line, but I'm going to link down below a post about how Jacquard performs color by color if you're interested in seeing that. I'm using these Platinum Micro 10 Gram Minis from Wool to Die For, and they are in the pot soaking. I have also made tags to keep these colors together. And we're going to be using a jeweler's scale for 0.1 of a gram, which is going to be a 10 or 1% degree of strength color on our micro minis. Okay, let's see. Looking very little dye. Alrighty, that's already too much. That's twice as much as we need. And there we have it, 0.1 of a gram. Okay, I'm going to put this in the Dharma red. I'm going to repeat that with the rest of these. And we're going to mix the tap as hot as it goes. And in it goes. Now we're going to make a water bath. We're going to let this run for about 45 minutes and cool to room temperature. Now I can already see we've got some graininess right here in the Pro Chem Red. And I broke it up but there was a scum on the top of this. You can see some of it right here. And again, more graininess. Now, the Permaset color is not red, it's hot pink, but it's called Permalon Red, so we'll see what that does. And I'm gonna take these dyes, they're totally cool room temperature, and we're just gonna dump them in the bucket to see if there's any tint to the water. Looks like all the dye is absorbed. If there's any patchiness or graininess, which I don't see, and we're gonna go and make our notes on our little sheet. This is Dharma's Fluorescent Lemon. Looks good. Okay, on closer inspection, there is the tiniest yellow tint to the water. I don't know if you can see that. Prochem Yellow. This is Flavine Yellow, and looks clear to me. Dharma Turquoise. And as you can see, there at 1%, there's still some dye left in the water. Just a tiny tint, but it's there. Prochem Turquoise. Same thing, we've got a little bit of tint to the water. And yeah, standard colors blue. That is really close to crystal clear. Uh, yeah, I would say that is crystal clear, actually. Now we're going to start with the problem child, typically anyway, Dharma's Fire Engine Red. It's really surprising, it's totally clear. Jacquard Scarlet. And that's definitely a tint in the water. Slight, but it's there. Prochem Bright Red. And again, very slight tint to the water and standard colors Permalon Red. That is crystal clear, folks, but it is clearly pink. We're gonna let these dry overnight and check in on them tomorrow for color comparisons in the sun.
So here are the three yellows. This is obviously a sunflower or, you know, standard um, primary yellow, whereas these two are fluorescent. This one bled a little bit. This one and this one did not. So here are our blues, standard blue, Dharma turquoise, Prochem turquoise. And um, there was a slight tint to the water in both the Dharma and Prochem, but the standard blue was perfectly clear. I think this is kind of a dusty blue comparatively. This one is clearly, in my opinion, the winner. It's more saturated and vibrant than the other two. Not a bad blue, but it was $70 for a tub of one pound of it, so I don't know that I'll buy this again. And here's our reds. All three of these colors left a slight tint in the water, and at 1% that's kind of disappointing. Um, but reds are notorious for bleeds. This is the only one that was completely clear, but it is obviously pink. These two look almost identical, the Prochem and the Jacquard red. The Dharma red is slightly pink-based red. These are a little bit orange-based red, so none of them are a true neutral red. Hope you enjoyed this video.